it's a good job I'm a big fan of Donald Duck because sometimes he really does make me roll my eyes. I really enjoyed Donald's Goldmine. This is a 1942 short directed by Dick Lundy. And of course we have Clarence Nash as Donald the Duck. Um, I don't know why I put the the in there. Donald Duck. And Donald is digging in the gold mine for gold. And needless to say, Donald and wealth just don't seem to go hand in hand because I kind of imagine he'd he'd be the person who'd win the lottery, blow it all in one day and get very exasperated. But nevertheless, he's putting in the labour, he's putting in the hard work, he's digging for gold. And he, of course, finds gold. And his burrow, his burrow is absolutely adorable. I'm not sure if this is the same burrow that featured in the one where he was replacing the burrow's shoes, but I think it is. And this burrow definitely has a vendetta against Donald because it goes out of its way to make everything very difficult for Donald and quite dangerous as well. I won't say exactly what happens, but I really enjoyed it. I thought the setting of the gold mine worked well, kind of gave me, you know, buzzy nostalgia feelings from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs with the dwarfs going um, diamond mining, of course. Uh, but other than that, the similarities are not the same. But I really enjoyed it. We have some beautiful earthy tones and shiny golds and the burrow is absolutely adorable. And of course, Donald Duck's behaviour is fabulous. Oh, I love watching him get irritated. There are times when things were quite dangerous for him, which obviously was not as pleasing. But generally speaking, Donald's gold mine was a lot of fun. Well animated, lovely narrative structure from start to finish. I had a lot of fun with it. The burrow definitely made it a little bit extra special because it really is very cute. Donald's gold mine, if you're a fan of Disney or a fan of Donald Duck, is certainly worth watching.